Guys, my nan and granddad gave me a Christmas mug years ago. And as you can tell, I am in full Christmas mode with my festive PJs. And I feel like it's only right to start the day with a cup of tea in my Christmas mug. And I saw it in the cupboard a few days ago. Oh, it's up there. And it's just time to get it out. Happy 2nd of December guys, I cannot believe it's the second day. I feel like everyone started getting festive really really early this year, like I think it was all to do with social media, like on TikTok I was seeing people put up their tree like the 5th of November, like literally literally on firework night or even before firework night. So yeah, a lot of people got into the Christmas spirit quite early, which I'm not mad about, I'm honestly not. It just shocked me, you know? But it is nice to finally be in December and for it to fully be acceptable to be on like full Christmas mode. Got a busy few weeks leading up to Christmas, but I'm very excited and very grateful. But yeah, gonna have a really nice day today. My auntie and uncle are actually staying around to experience London at Christmas. So yeah, I'm very excited to show them around, all the Christmassy parts, all the beautiful lights. So it's gonna be a really good day. You know what time it is? It's advent calendar time. Also guys, you know, I always like to fold the corners of my doors. I just think it makes the calendar look so much neater. Well, you have to rip all the foil off first and then you can fold the little door. Ta-da! Number two. What have we got today, Lena Rue?
good evening. Just thought I would jump on here and talk to you about the film that I have finished. You know I love a Christmas film. I love a cheesy rom-com, but my goodness, I do not recommend that film. That was, um, Eli even had to leave the room because he couldn't stand the first, how long were you here for the first 10 minutes? The first 10 minutes and he was like, I can't do this and he had to leave. So yeah, I would not, <laughs> I wouldn't recommend this film guys. I would probably rate it out of 10, a three. What would you rate it? Oh, I'd be generous because it's Christmas of four. A, f <laughs> a two. <laughs> Four, one more up. Uh, yeah, it wasn't the best. And it's a shame because I think it had the real, like, festive factor because the main character was really Christmassy and, you know, it was all about the Christmas magic and that was brilliant, but the storyline was pants. There was no good storyline whatsoever. And it got halfway through the film and I just didn't really know how it was going to go. And it just didn't really, do you agree? It yeah, just was a bit, it was a bit bland. It was very bland. Um, so I wouldn't recommend it. I definitely think there are better Christmas films out there to watch. But I thought I would just let you guys know so you don't waste an hour and a half of your evening. But um, I will probably watch another Christmas film another evening and I'll, let, I'll rate that for you so you can know. But I hope you have a great day and I will see you all tomorrow again. Bye.